All right, 719 video games, more than just entertainment these days. It turns out they're being used more and more to treat kids with attention deficit hyperactivity disorder. So let's talk about it. Joining us now, our tech expert, Hap Aziz. Hap, good to see you. Thanks for coming in this morning. Good morning, John. L let's start with this. Uh, for the longest time, video games were seen by many people to be evil because kids spent too much time and now they're being used as a treatment. Explain these treatments. Well, the, the treatments are based on the idea that uh, you can use uh, something called neurofeedback, which is a technique that NASA pioneered to help their pilots focus more. As you understand, uh, pilots need to focus on tasks and they can be doing repetitive things over long periods of time. So NASA developed a technique that allows them to practice their focus. They, then NASA decided or determined that you know you might be able to apply those techniques to video games. So they did some research with a university where they found that using commercial video game systems like the Xbox, the PlayStation, you could use regular off-the-shelf games and use the techniques of neurofeedbacks to get to get people to focus people with ADHD some autistic folks and even even regular people that just have a little bit of problem focusing but what's interesting here Hap is that a lot of uh, medical experts say that these video games are part of the problem because it's rewiring our brain in ways we're not supposed to be dealing with so how do they have it both ways saying it's part of the problem and now it's helping solve the problem well the video games when they're just played without any structured activity or without any of the uh, uh, neurofeedback technology hooked up, sure, the, the children, the people playing it can be uh, a little unfocused. But the idea with neurofeedback is there's actually sensors that are attached to a person's head and it, uh, it starts to read the brain waves so that the game system itself gets feedback from the player and you can only move further or get positive reinforcement in the game if you're thinking the correct way, relaxing the proper brain waves. All right, thanks a lot, Hap. Good to see you once again. Thanks sure. for coming in this morning. Hap Aziz, our tech expert here on Fox 35.